Have you ever been working really hard to solve a problem or trying to figure something out? Do you notice that when you actually leave the task and come back to it, it gets easier? So I've been thinking about what's actually going on here. This actually relates to the psychology of creativity and how our brains process information. So basically, when you leave a task, maybe overnight or when you go to the gym or when you go for a walk, your brain goes into something called an incubation period. Now, psychologists have been talking about incubation periods since the 1920s. And basically what it involves is, is the unconscious processes in our brain, which continue to draw connections between different pieces of information when we actually switch off. So when we go to sleep overnight, during REM sleep, rapid eye movement sleep, when we dream, we actually hyper-associate different parts or different pieces of information uh, together in unusual and novel ways. And this actually gives us rich insight to solving problems. So a major brain network here is called the default mode network. Now, this has come around the last 20 years. Neuroscientists have been looking at it. And it's basically a major region of the brain that switches on when we're not focused on something. So if you think daydreaming or your imagination or kind of your default emotional processing, this all involves the default mode network, this major brain region, um, which switches on, literally switches on. And you can see this uh, in neuroimaging when we're not concentrating on something. And that's one of the reasons why these novel solutions or novel insights to problems really come about when we're not focused on the task at hand.